hello guys welcome back to my channel today we're gonna review one of the most hyped clones in the fragrance world this is latafa asad so before we move forward i would like to request you to please like subscribe and press the bell icon to receive the latest notification of my upcoming videos I was receiving some uh, suggestions regarding my voice quality and my uh, shaky week videos. So I I put some like this mic to uh, make it more better, and I put my uh, equipment on a tripod. So uh, the videos are not <clears throat> so shaky like before. So I hope. It increased the video quality for you guys. So let's start with the review. We have uh, Latafa Asad with us. This is the packaging. I really like this texture on the box. This is the branding over here as well. And here is the information of batch code let's just unbox it so here is the bottle this is the branding on cap on bottom there is a sticker It's a three-dimensional bottle. It's very good. Like I actually don't like the presentation much for the Asad, but it is it is beautiful. It is eye-catching. So people people say that this is the clone of Dior Sauvage Elixir. Somehow it is. Uh, it resembles with the fragrance of Dior Sauvage Elixir but there are some like uh, it does differ from Elixir as well this is this this is actually different as well although it is very like uh, familiar with that DNA but the DNA here is a bit different we cannot say that it's the hundred percent clone of Dior Sauvage Elixir. It's basically uh, to my nose what I got from this fragrance is like you can say it's like 30% 20% it resembles with uh, Dior Sauvage ADT version and then 70-80% it's uh, resembles to Elixir. So if we discuss about the notes of uh, Asad it's warm spicy there is vanilla amber it's a bit powdery and it's woody however uh, what i feel the main difference with asad and elixir is the elixir is more towards lavender side and it's more aromatic than the asad so it's the main difference it's not that aromatic and i don't feel I don't smell any identical lavender fragrance in this specific perfume. So this makes a bit different from Dior Sauvage Elixir. But keeping, uh, uh, considering the price point, it's like 10 times cheaper than Elixir. And it smells approximately the same as Elixir. So I think it's a very good bargain uh, for a fragrance if you want to if you don't want to like uh, invest too much money and you want to enjoy fragrance of your Sauvage elixir in just like 30 dollars 25 30 dollars so uh, this is this is for you and it's a very good fragrance uh, regardless of fragrance the Dior Sauvage elixir is a beast mode perfume like it projects very well it has a very good sillage and the longevity of elixir is like 12 13 14 15 plus hours 
so it's a beast mode perfume i have i have been uh, reviewing reviewing uh, like a uh, lot of other uh, reviews on the media and i got to know that this as per people this is also a beast mode performer i tested it like number of times number of times i tested this fragrance and i to to my nose to my body to my uh, to my experience it's not that much beast mode performer but it easily performs 8 plus hours like if you are purchasing this perfume keeping this thing in mind that it will perform 10 12 plus hours so i think this is not the case although 8 plus hours 9 plus hours is a very good longevity for any perfume keeping the price point this is so cheap less expensive and a very long lasting but it's not a beast mode to to me to me to my body to my nose it's not a beast mode perfume but still it performs very well it performs better than lots of the uh, designer fragrances out there in the market so it's a very good bargain although uh, uh the uh, the the longevity is like uh, eight plus hours but the projection in start of like projection in first couple of hours or three is very good it projects very good in first two hours then it it becomes like the skin scent for next six seven eight hours so overall uh, dior sauvage elixir if you don't want to buy that perfume at that price point and if you want to enjoy the fragrance of dior sauvage elixir so this one is a very very better alternate for you it's from the house of latafa and it's latafa asad a highly recommended perfume for you so uh, this was all about t- t- today's uh, review if you like uh, the review please like the video and subscribe to my channel thank you very much